Hello, everybody. It's I, the Willowigi Big Mac. And Diamond Party Company 4. Welcome back to Dead Rising Deluxe Remaster. Last time, uh, we fought a bunch of psychopaths last time, didn't we? Uh, I think so. And we saved some survivors. Let's see. Yeah, do you want do you want to change outfits first? Yeah, we should probably change outfits real quick before we start heading towards uh, uh the meeting. Who do you want to switch to? While um, we uh. Show this off because we didn't get to the last time. Yeah, it's uh, failed recording. Yep. Uh, I'm thinking the bunny. The bunny? That bloody bunny. Alright. The Willamette bunny. Don't mind me, I'm going out there. <laughs> but yeah, if I recall correctly, we beat up Cliff, Joe... Ran, we ran into the uh, the cultists. Yeah. Worst possible timing, by the way. In case you yeah, guys. Got, well, well, got, unfortunately, wasn't able to save the victim. Yep. Um. Because Cliff's uh, survivor. Let's see. There's there's, there's two more. Stupid. There's a few more ways to fight. I think we had to, we had to, we had to fight Is uh, Isabella. Yes, we did. Uh, I think. Left. I think, I think there's a few others that I might be forgetting. If anything, we should probably head to uh, North Plaza and just... Let's see. Do you remember when... Uh, Mr. Gets His Crotch Burned uh, shows up? That's on day three. Day three? Okay, okay, so okay, it's day three. Okay, then, then I shouldn't then I shouldn't have any problems uh, going to Wonderland Wonderland Plaza then. Uh, first yeah, things first. I'm pretty sure he doesn't. Okay, he I, doesn't should show probably, up, I should probably. I, I, I should probably. After you, you know about. Oof. Oh, Floyd's dead. <laughs> I, for, I forgot we left him for dead. Yeah, we didn't have time to listen to his ramblings. Yep. Okay, we gotta quickly grab uh, grab some healing because we gotta get going. Yep. And because and because we got um, what do you call it? Yeah, we're, we're, we're yeah we, we we shouldn't blend anymore. We should really get going. Weren't you supposed to go meet that girl? You know how women can be when you break your promise. Fuck that guy in particular. Jeez. Up. We, oh wow, we can do that already. Okay, we're just now noticing them. <laughs> They've been all throughout the mall. Yep. Well, we can. Well, we can finally get rid of these fuckers. Well, let's let's get Isabel safe back to safety. He's got bad luck. Yep. Yep, so we're gonna deal with that uh after we deal with this Isabella first. Luckily this takes us near the grocery store, which means we have access to the motorcycle. Which means we can just drive to the destination, so we don't have to worry about uh being late for too much longer. Ow! Fucker. Okay, uh, zombie, this is not the time to be shooting us because we have somewhere to be. We have a lady waiting for us. Yep. So, so how do you think Frank just heals from all these bullet wounds from these from these zombies, and then Cletus, and then uh, and then Steven, and every other person who's beaten his ass? Ooh, shit! Get back up there. <laughs> sorry, sorry, folks. I have no clue how to ride a motorcycle properly. Oh, this guy's here. You all right? We're we're just we're just gonna ignore this guy. Damn it. Oh. Okay. Not the time. Okay, where the fuck are we supposed to meet her? Uh. I, oh, I think it's right here. Yeah, right here. Okay. 
Okay, I got scared for a second. I didn't know. <laughs> don't don't mind don't mind the blood. Sorry, 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 but that was the best way again. Uh... Were you bitten? No, it was Carlito. I tried to talk him into coming, but it was no good. He, he doesn't trust anyone. He shot you? He didn't mean to. He was upset. I don't know what he'll do next. <laughs> You know, I should pro. I should probably. I should. You know what? I should probably pick up some uh, some shotguns before I deal with those cultists. That would help. Yep. I, it, I'm sorry. I got distracted by the cutscene. It looks so funny in this outfit. Yep. I'm so sorry. I never meant to shoot you. Don't, Hagen. Though, no. uh, we're just we're just gonna leave you to your own devices, okay? So anyway, as so anyway, as we're transporting her, we're gonna be Ozzy. Like, are the cultists still there? Okay, I think it's annoying that zombies can bitch slap you off of it. Okay, at least the cultists are not over here anymore. Okay, excellent. So. Oh shit! This uh, this is a PB sticker here. Ah, yeah. son of a bitch! Don't don't play with the DualShock Four controller, folks. All right, let me shotgun, shotgun. Nice try, zombie. You fucking suck. Yeah, at least the coatless weren't over there because they they tend to be over there. Yep. I think they despawn the cultists just because you have to carry Isabella back and they don't want they don't want them to cause problems. Yeah. Also you're just pushing the zombie. I mean, I highly doubt they're gonna be able to do anything. Yeah, we are leaving that survivor. He is the most fucking annoying survivor that you could get. And we're not even gonna bother with him. Because yep. he's a dick. Yeah, so he is one of the few survivors required for the transmission area achievement, which we're not going to be even be getting, unfortunately, because we missed a couple survivors that. Well, we missed. Well, a we missed a couple survivors, and B we actually just outright missed one of Otis's calls because they never popped up in time. So, so with this, so with this in mind, uh, and and that's just assuming the transmission area achievement is even still in. Is still I even it is. like it wouldn't surprise me if it is, but yeah. The other thing about uh, Kendall there, I think that's what his name is. Yeah, is that he is one of the few uh, survivors that can cause a uh, a mutiny. Yeah, he, his his whole mutiny is that he thinks that he doesn't believe that there's a helicopter coming, and him and the group of survivors that he's in the room with are gonna go steal cars and go towards the the escape Willamette through the borders. Which but, is a uh, terrible idea. Which is a terrible idea because we know that there are, you know, the borders are shut down by military, so they'll die. So, plus, he is just too wild with that shotgun. Yep. It could it could end up uh, hurting Isab Isabella even more. And it, he's more of a liability of anything. He'll probably do just fine on his own. He has a shotgun. He's near the gun store. You can always just grab another. And then he dies. Oh my god, the loading screen. Just, oh, there we go. Yep. It just it just really just didn't want to load, huh? 
I guess they really had to decide whether if we, if they want us to deal with the fucking cultists. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Okay. I'm going to go up the, rather than go through the cultists, I'm going to go up the stairs because, because these guys shouldn't be fast enough to be able to follow us. Yeah, we got too far. Yeah. Yeah, we we ran far enough away to the point where those cultists should not even be following us anymore. Because, yeah, I think I think we're heading into day three. That's about when a lot of the hidden survivors show up. And we got our last couple psychopaths. We don't have that many left. Yep. Yep, we know there's we know there's one that gets her, that gets her balls burnt. Yeah. And hey, blame me. That one's that one's a funny one. <laughs> However, oh, you know who else we dealt with? We dealt with the snipers, and that's when we got to learn that you could actually spare Thomas. Yeah, that's actually, yeah. Which it it never popped up if Thomas actually died or not, but. So, if anything, he might still be alive. He might just... If, if we go back there and he's still there, then he's still there. Yep. If, if he's gone, then he might have just yep. left on his own. Yep. Which, you know, like, honestly... Like, honestly, I'm kind of glad that, that they added the option to be able to spare Thomas. I think I think that's... Yeah, that, was, that, was a, that was a pretty neat change. That was so bad. Be, yeah, because, like, it Thomas... Was so bad killing him. Yeah, because Thomas, like... He just seemed like he like a poor kid that was being peer pressured by his, his dad and, and the older brother. Follow me. Okay, okay, there we go. Unfortunately, the stupid knife uh, was there and took priority over me picking up Isabella. Mm -hmm. I always, I always notice that if you're carrying, uh, like, if the game realizes you have a survivor that you have to carry, I think it spawns less zombies in the elevator. Or at least for story important missions like this one. Yeah. If that's true, then it's pretty cool. Hold on, I have to shove uh, Isabella again. Who is that? Is she hurt? Uh, yeah. <sighs> Looking at the bad guy's sister. The bad guy? The one who caused all this? That's right. Her asshole brother caused the zombie outbreak. <sighs> His sister? What in the hell is going on here? I mean, does this have anything to do with that announcement earlier? I don't know much more than you at this point, okay? But he shot her, I can tell you that. And just so you know, that would be the same guy that shot you. What's he after? What's his ultimate goal? I don't know. But according to her, his plan isn't over. Not yet. All right. I think we. Sh I think we're gonna stick around with the bunnies suit a bit more. Her in DHS custody. We'll question her when she wakes up. <laughs> Whatever, man. Whatever. I'm still so annoyed that you got rid of my uh, coffee creamers. Yeah, it's, if you think of it this way, I think the reason the coffee creamers stopped spawning is because Brad hasn't been... Uh, at that point when they stopped, when they disappear, that's when Brad's injured and he can't go out and get more. Yep. And he probably hasn't gone out uh, since him getting injured. Yep. Yeah, because I'm going to say this much. We're definitely going to need to make some quick step for that one mission. Mm-hmm. Because at the moment, I don't feel like dealing with conflicts to get to uh, the one place we need to be for that mm -hmm. mission. Which means which means we can't get the specific key o object that would make the mission easier. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna. Okay, we're gonna go heal up. We're gonna have to wing it. 
Yep, but luckily, if we have Quick Step, it shouldn't be... That shouldn't make things a lot... Like, honestly, I'm thinking about just keeping the Chainsaw on. And with a bunch of Quick Step? Yeah, just just have a bunch of Quick Step. I think that's probably the the best way we I, can... I, I've been able to handle that section by myself without the key, so... Yeah. It's yeah, although, although, it's... although, to be fair, the original, it was, like, a lot... It was a lot more fucking difficult. Up, oh, Kindle's dead. Bye, Kendall. We never liked you. <laughs> yep, yep. We never, we never liked you. So, uh, good riddance. Oh, oh. oh, you know, you know what I realized too is when we get to that mission, we gotta deal with uh, fuckface again. Oh one, yeah. One last time. Oh yeah, dipshit. You don't mm -hmm. actually have to kill him, by the way. You do get it. You do get an extra cutscene if you do. But uh, but he's not required. You can actually just complete the mission without killing him. Which is fine, because he's... Cause... Now, I'm not sure how easier... How much more easier they made that mission, but... He is a bitch to kill. Oh, I wasn't talking about Carlito. Oh! I'm talking about Ken. Oh, that guy. Okay. Sorry, I misunderstood yeah. who you meant. Because uh, that those trigger about the same time. If right. if I, if time, I time, for, time for us to deal with these damn cultists. If I recall uh, correctly, as soon as you leave the office for that one mission, Penn's mission, uh, you have to get you have to quickly get to the. Yeah, uh, so notice how n all the area. zombies have uh, disappeared. Oh, Jesus Christ. I shot at him. It did not it did not register register him as being shot. Let's see. It was this one right here we have to go into, right? I believe so. No, it was No. Uh, it, was four. it was four that we had to go into. There we go. <laughs> this asshole. Rose who rejects salvation. Ignorance. Hopefully the cultists are a bitch to, uh, to kill once we kill this fucker. Mm -hmm. I still love his, like, his little jewel that's, like, a third eye. It's a nice touch. tainted blood. The foul earth that has you. Yeah, so, fun fact, about half the psychopaths in this game actually has copyrighted music, including this guy. And I do know, and I do know his song, uh, can actually, uh, can actually cause, uh, Okay, so landing, jumping and landing still, uh, counts for, uh, <laughs> oh, you know what? Oh, Jesus. I find I find it stup stupid that that can't work. Hold up. That like that he that he can hit you even if he physically misses you with the sword. That is a bit weird. Jesus fucking Christ. Jesus. Oh my god! Run, 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 run. Okay, you, you're a fucking dick. <laughs> god. Well, folks, that was the closest we ever came to death. And that's just because this, this dude... His one sword move just kept hitting me, even though he physically missed. Which oh, I... it's still the most first of, uh, second yep. most first death of the game. I mean, hey, it's, it, they're called the true light cult for a reason. Mm-hmm. A truly ironic fate for, for what they call their cult. 
Now. Might as well take care of them first. See, I should have enough bullets to take care of all, the, of all these guys. I know the original, if you hit these guys once, they will immediately pull out the bomb and try to suicide bomb you regardless of how further back you were. Okay, there's only a few... Like two more of these guys left. There's a third one that just popped out of nowhere. Hey, not gonna lie, that kind of scared me for a second. Jeez. Okay, what is with the clown car of fucking cultists? Oh god. Oh, come on, you assholes! <laughs> Please tell me that was all of them. Okay, I, th I think that was all of them. Are you all right? Holy shit, there was no reason why that needed to be that fucking difficult. Okay, that's okay, I'm glad. I'm glad that they changed the AI where they start don't start immediately running in and trying to and immediately try to start killing these guys. Because in the original, if you when he killed Sean, but they would immediately just start attacking the uh, the survivors. Oh, the, do the door what? We, you also do get this book, which allows, which allows, uh, no, no longer fear of death, and really to jump in danger, which is, you know, you get the fuck out of there. Yep. Over here. Hurry. Please. They're going to kill me. They want to sacrifice. Uh, you could have a sword. Just save me. Anything, huh? Sounds like fun. Anyway. I took care of those two. You're safe now. Hey! No! Bat! Bat survivor! Bat! Give me the fucking sword. Their leader's finished. Though, there may be a few other This place is dangerous. You ready to blow this joint? Thanks. I'll follow you anywhere. Huh. Yep, so Cheryl's design, they actually changed uh, from the... I personally like it. Yeah, yeah. She's Cheryl... still seductive looking, yeah, but Cheryl she's not was a Yeah, Cheryl was her. originally a bit more... Uh... Her, her original design made her more, look more like an exotic, like, exotic person. Like, extremely exotic. Okay, no more... Okay, that's... Okay, we got all five. Come on! She was much, much, much more scantily dressed. Which I know a lot of people are upset that her design is to change something more that covers her more, but th th those are just weirdos. Yep. I personally don't All mind right. her new dress. It's really pretty. Okay, we got Beth, we got Nathan, we got Ray, Michelle, and Cheryl. All five made it out right. Which is, which is more than what we can say happened uh, if we were playing the original. Yeah, they would have, uh, it would have been much worse. Yeah, half of them would either end up getting themselves killed because the AI sucks in that game, or, or they end up getting severely damaged from the cultist. Or being left behind. Yep. Let's show what you're doing up there. Mm 
I'm not I'm not too concerned about um Oh come on Oh, oh. Jesus Christ Cheryl Cheryl Go. I'm gonna have Okay Uh, she's talking about, uh, the untouchable, uh, juice. Yeah, once you deal with the cultists, all of them, all of them stop, uh, for the most part, uh, appearing. Which is a yeah, godsend, because whatever... they, because they were really annoying, because they deal a shit ton of damage to survivors. Okay, can you do stop fucking with the zombies? I get a show. You're a whore, but but you don't need to be fighting them a bunch. Okay, you know what? I think at this point you might you might as well just spam the uh, call and get them to the door. How you can manhandle by a zombie? You have a fucking sword. Come on, Cheryl, hurry up. We are going to be late to this story thing. If we if we become late for the story thing, uh, where all these survivors are dying. Okay. If anything, head to the elevator right away. Just just open it. Fuck it. Uh, no wasting time. Worst comes to worst, if we leave them behind, they will not die because it will take it. They won't die during the cutscene. We cannot wait for all of them. Okay, they should all be close enough. Yep, we got all of them. Okay, we got all of them. It, it, just run, 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 run. Run, 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 Okay, I think they're all up here. Oh, yep. pretty yep and just in the nigga fucking time what is your name isabella isabella keys well isabella this is an emergency so we'll skip the formality and cut to the chase consider this an official interrogation Tell me everything that you know. Fine. I'll explain why all of this is your fault. There was no drug trade in Santa Cabeza. Just an American research facility. They were doing research on some sort of parasitic insect. Like a wasp. A wasp that turns living things into zombies. If you don't believe me, just ask the man who was in charge of that research. The head of the Santa Cabeza Livestock Research Facility, Dr. Barnaby! Huh? 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 Uh oh! Oh! The old man's gone feral! I think I think the old man's dead. Oh no, he's kicking his stuff. Tell me the truth, Doc. Were you conducting experiments with zombies?
this old man's nuts. We should put him out of his misery. You know, it sounds like she, he's like bombing in like blood or something, but you don't see any. So the government's now in the zombie making business. The whole story about the drug trade was a cover up. What do you know? We were trying to mass produce cattle. <laughs> Do you? Henny! Hi there. How much meat Americans consume in a single day? Well, a lot because it's part of our the recommended diet. That research yeah. was absolutely yeah. necessary. Uh, <laughs> man, just die already. <laughs> okay, you told us the truth. Just kill over and die already, old man. I don't know if he's got more to say. I mean, I mean, to be fair, he. Mm, for those of us who knows how this whole game ends, he's kind of not wrong. Mm-hmm. Really, Frank? Where George? Up? Oh, oh wow! Suddenly, his his skin already began to begin to to rot. That was fast. Yep. Also, this in case you guys can't tell, this is a cutscene, obviously. So. I love how this is shot. In my village, the people turned into zombies. Hold on, uh, hold on. I know how to make this immersive. Wasps. They escaped from the lab. In case you guys couldn't hear that dowsy steam screenshot. It wasn't long before they got to work. The zombies spread. The army was called in. They killed everyone. Brad, this is where you're one woman to look cool. Damn, that's still cool as shit. Yep. Good, good thing the good thing the voice actor didn't uh, fuck up that one. Mm -hmm. Well, not really. Well, again, not really the voice actor's fault. It's mainly the voice coach. Mm -hmm. Or the uh, voice director. Voice director. That's the correct term. Sounds plausible. Or it could be some serious bullshit. In either case, we have to get out of here alive if we want to find out for sure. We have to check if she's been bitten. Let me take a look. <sighs> I'm a medical technician. I could be useful if you let me do my job. I know I have no right to ask, but please let me help. I, I like how Isabella has basically turn a new leaf because because her asshole brother shot her. I wouldn't blame her. Yep. I, I mean, like, if my sibling fucking shot me in the arm, i go like, okay, you're a fucking dick. Mm. Fuck you. <laughs> mm. If if I see you at the after house at Christmas, I'm fucking leaving. Makes things go more smoothly for us. I'm all for it. Luckily, she would never do that. So you have to worry about it. Yep, luckily. So with that, 11 a.m. But uh, we got some time. Yep, yeah, we got some. Um, we got some time. Uh, but I'm pretty sure all the 
a lot of the hidden survivors are about to pop up. And some known survivors are going to pop up. First... Um, if anything, we have... We haven't got the call, call about the long-headed uh, punk yet, so we might as well make our way to the food court to make a lot of quick step. Yep. Yeah, because we really... Because quick step will help us catch the asshole. But it's also going to make our... Uh, also, fuck that guy. Man, man, we only, man, we only used a quarter of this thing. Yeah, it it lasts really long. I for, I forgot to set a uh, timer again. Ah, it's okay. Yeah, I don't worry. I checked uh, how long we're going for, so I so I can so I can roughly estimate uh, what we're going to need to do. Mm -hmm. Okay, but you know, what, you know what? First, but first, we're gonna jump cut that a bit because because I actually need to use the bathroom really badly. Hold on. All right, folks, we are back, and uh, sorry, sorry, I had to jump cut there because my dinner tonight just didn't agree with me, and uh, I just couldn't hold it in much longer. But on the other hand, I'm kind of glad that I did do a jump cut because apparently my computer, by the time I got back down to where my computer was, it re it apparently rebooted. So the game, so the game, so the game was like I had to reboot the game and everything. Yeah, and I and I, I was in call, and then all of a sudden, I was not in call because uh, Discord's little bot kicked me out because I was the only one in call. Yep. So I don't know if my computer blue screened while it's gone or not really annoyed that it happened, but luckily the autosave didn't take us too far back. Only a couple seconds. So, so at the moment everything should be fine for the most part. Oh, oh. Yeah, it just brought us back to the B. It just brought us back to the door to going to the safe room. So, it, really, we just have to walk to the bathroom again. Yep, so yeah, so thank, thank God for that. Uh, Thank God for autosave, because if this was the original game, we would be crying at a quarter, because a corner having to redo shit. And at that point, we might as well just redo the episode. Uh-huh. Yeah, so... But we don't have to worry about that, then. Thankfully, yeah, thank so, God for autosave. So as, we, so as we stated earlier... Oh! You know what? Is, oh, Gil's here! You know what? This works out, then. We can, we can take Gil back. Yep. Okay, let's talk to Gil. What the hell are you doing in here? <laughs> Feel like a drink, partner? <laughs> no cover charge. Worthless drunk. Don't you know what's going on out there? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know. That's exactly why I'm drinking. <laughs> you expect me to stay sober in this situation, asshole? You know what? I'm just gonna leave him there for a moment, make some quick step, come back, and then continue talking to him. And get bitten by a zombie, apparently, because these guys are assholes. Gil could wait. He should be fine. Yep, luckily, and luckily, all the cultists are gone because we killed their leader. Although, why would you drink wine to get drunk? Like, personally, I would rather get drunk off of, like, like rum or uh, whiskey. Well, I'd get drunk off of Malibu if I really wanted to. That counts as rum, babe. It's it's coconut rum. I, I know that. I'm just saying specifically what kind of rum I want to get drunk on. Yep. Yeah, you, know, you know, I tried wine once. I didn't like it. Yeah, I, I'm a wine tricker, but not too much. Goddamn 
Zombies, come on, come and get me. Hope you can hold your liquor though, because I'm soaking in it. There we go. Perfect. Nice. Oh, and we got a hat. Yep. Look, there's a helicopter coming. If you want to be on it, you'll come with me. I already got someone coming to get me. Angels. Beautiful yep. angels. <laughs> Zombies, angels, people, whatever. Let's all get drunk. <laughs> Oh, this is where you have to walk away from him. Right, yeah. Maybe not. Oh, there we go. Someone's really coming for us? For sure? Trust me or not, that's your choice. Oh, no! Take me with you! I'm going! <laughs> you know, this is honestly how I thought he would sound. Oh, yep. Yep. Also, he automatically drinks his wine. And as you guys can obviously tell, wine is definitely his favorite. He's one of those... He's a carrying uh, survivor, so he's not too hard to take back. But, I yeah. I think we, we still have enough to call about the punk, so we could take him back through the other way instead of the long way with, this, with the convicts. Yep. For, uh, for now... We're gonna. I would. I. I would. I would just blend that at the thing so we don't accidentally trigger the long-haired uh, punk. Cause I don't know how long until he that call we get that call. You know what? Fair enough. Cause yeah, the thing about the long the long-haired punk is that if you go into the air, the Be I, it's. Be firing a gun near a propane tank. Who? You want to hit it by accident. Who knows if it's the same in this game? But in the original game, if you had went into the area where the long-haired punk mission was going on uh with survivor or like say you had went in there just out of like necessity to use the shortcut sometimes the just that are with that psychopath will die before you even get back there so that's why we're kind of just in a little a little bit of a rush oh i didn't mean to give him my my wine Ah, boo. Fucking hell. Oh, well. I guess I can always run back to grab more. Because quick step is definitely what we're going to need for... Uh, to deal with long hair punk, because... He's... Okay. First thing first... I can't wait we get through the game where all these fuck stupid fucking zombies are dying. Mm-hmm. You know, you know, you know, I'm not surprised we find uh Gil we found Gil to meet immediately. Yeah, he's usually a third day survivor at yep. like around night time. Yeah, yep. well, morning, early, early morning. Yeah, part of me wants to say there's an, another survivor. There are two other, there are, there is one, I think, I think one of them is hidden, the other one is call, as a call. Right. I, or, or they might both be hidden. I know, yeah, I, pretty, the, sure. I know there's one that's hidden yeah, that I'm, I know about that is in that area. Yeah, I was about to say, there was definitely, I'm pretty sure there's another hidden survivor uh, that spawns alongside Gil. Gil was just the one we found first, and honestly... Okay, there we go. We're, we're going to take Gil back first, and then we're going to go deal with... Uh, uh, with that nerd. And that's why I said he's going to, uh, burn his balls off. Mm-hmm. Uh, there is the chance that the hidden survivor does show up. I think, I think there's two hidden survivors. I can't, I don't remember if the guy is the one who is also hidden, but I know the woman is, 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 is a hidden one. There is a possibility that they will both spawn while you're doing the long-haired survivor. Come on. The best course of action is to, uh, hide them in a store while you're, uh, 
fighting. Consider my buzz officially killed. Now I've got to start getting my drink on all over again. Well, too bad. Unfortunately, Dude, how is your buzz gone? You literally fucking chugged a whole bottle of wine for you came here. Yep. I'd be on the floor. All right. Well, let's make our way to uh, to that long hair punk. Chances are we're probably gonna have to drink one of our quick stuffs just to catch up with him. Either either that or hope that that you can just stun lock him again. Because I know in the original you can actually just cheese the fight by stun locking him with the chainsaw. Gotta gotta love these zombie ragdolls. Hey, <laughs> he knocked that one down. Excellent. We're getting through this faster than I thought we were. I mean, to be f I feel like this whole game is just overall faster. Yeah, it does feel a little faster than usual. Yeah, I mean, obviously it's a bit... No, we're not going to be saying that when we get to the freaking final part where we have to wait forever to leave. Well, I mean... Well, wait for our helicopter. Well, they kind of removed that problem. Yeah, I know, but... <laughs> It always feels a little cheap waiting and uh, wait uh, using. Uh, it, it feels slightly cheap because knowing in the original, we'd, we'd have to wait. But you, I mean, it's not a bad thing because we could use the time to level up and find PP stickers. Yep. But anyways, we just have to walk. Oh, this is the place. Bre. No, this is not the place. Actually, it might. It might be on this. Mm, one of these places on the first I, floor. I think it's on the right. You know, we should probably change our outfit out at some point. This, this is the place. Before we get back to the... Ooh, lighting. He sounds just like how I think he, he should sound. Ah, oh, Paul, you. That's pretty good. All right, I'm just gonna preemptively grab this. Oh, for fuck's sake! Not your. <laughs> I hate glass windows so much. Uh, 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 oh. That that was like a dog. That was like a dog situation. <laughs> the glass is so clean, you didn't even know it was glass. Okay, you want this? Well, Paul is not as annoying as he, uh, as, uh, as he, yet uh, as he used to be in the original. In the original, this... He, yeah, he had, he had dropping a lot of bombs like he usually did. Yeah, in the, yeah, the original, he would just run away, just drop Molotovs behind him. And I'm gonna make sure to have the fire hydrant out. Stay away from me! Don't come any closer! <laughs> And now you're getting your now you're getting your balls burnt. First thing first. Oh, yeah, that's hurt. Ow! Wait, what? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, you know what? I thought you, you know, I thought you had to aim. Okay. That was not my intention. We're good. Looks like you're no worse for wear. I, I, uh, I don't know what I was thinking. I'll never do anything like that again. If you promise to behave yourself and cooperate, I'll escort you to a safe place. Okay, I'll cooperate. My arson days are over. Yep. At, le at least it was easier to take to uh to put the fire out of his crotch. Everything's okay. Now. You don't have to be afraid. Wait, what is he doing here? Take you to a safer place. 
You feel up to a little trip? Okay, you just leave it to me. There we go. Uh, see, is the woman over on the left yet? On the right yet? Doesn't look like it. Nope, she's not there yet. Okay, so we don't have to worry about yeah, her. Yeah, she right won't now. be there until like early in the morning. Mm, okay. Yeah, unfortunately, I can't give Paul uh, one of my quick steps. And honestly, the quick step wasn't even necessary. Uh, if anything, it's necessary for later. Oh, yeah, 1%. When well, we get to that mission, but for now. Hey! No. Bad zombie. No gun. No gun. So, anyway, we should probably mention. Uh, Paul is. was the very first survivor they can actually have as a. Wait. Hold up. Wait, we have... Wait, we have that now? Come on! Wait. I think we would have gotten it from the picture. Wait. This woman, when did we get that guy's fucking their flash kick? Probably just a couple seconds ago. We did level up from that picture. Yeah, I guess. Let's see. Uh, jump... Okay, so... Mit... Okay, so... So, they changed how kickback works. It... Well, it's still the same thing. You have to tap A and tap X, but it, it, they made it easier to do. Mm. Let's see. And they still got Hammer Throw, which you have to do it as Zombie Side, which I haven't shown off yet, but that's just because it's not really... <gasps> Honestly, these guys should be fine to just bring back to the... Yeah, I wouldn't even worry about healing them. I think they will be fine. Yeah. I mean, like, if this was the original, I totally would have just bring them up to heal them. Just be... Just be but like... this is not as bad as before. Come on! Come on! Okay, they're still following behind me. Come on, uh, Mindy. Mindy. Uh, I think she's stuck on a zombie. No, wait, no, she's moving now. I'm just gonna. But yeah, Paul's one of the. Is the very first survivor in the series they can actually recruit as a survivor. Yeah, he, in this game, he's the only one. He does inspire another savable uh, psychopath in the uh, next game. Uh, Paul's dust. We're gonna need food to survive. Oh, Paul is dying. Jesus, man. I, could, I had it covered. You didn't have to... Okay, all of them should be close enough for us to be able to bring them back. And it's starting to turn daytime, which means some of the other survivors should start uh, spawning now. Yeah, uh, there should be, a, two of them are going to be in the area that we just were at. Thank you so much for your help. I'm not, I, I know one for a fact. One of them is. Oops. I know one of oh, them we have face is. Crusher. is face and zombies. R, okay, R and A for that one instead of R and X. So at least they're making it okay. easier. Also. He's just. It, it, he's just classified as a zombie. Anyway, we should probably take another picture of our. Of all of our survivors. Perfect. Perfect. 
Okay, get out of my way, please. There we go. Yeah, the room's looking pretty full. Yep. Yeah, we're definitely doing a good job saving survivors. We may have missed a couple people, but you know what? It's okay. Why is Nathan considered uh, on the brutal sides? Oh, he's uh, swinging his hands around. Okay. Let's go in here. We definitely got a few in here. Thanks. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. There we go. I just wanted to try and just take a picture of survivors. You know, we gotta have these memories, you know? I and think then... we're missing one room. That one. This is the last room. Not a whole lot of survivors, but... I think this is the room where we lost a lot of decent uh. lot of survivors. Yep. Uh. But, I mean, it is what it is. Yeah. Anyway, we got ourselves a snazzy little hat. Anyways. I think the only person we have to take a picture of is uh, Isabella. Right, yeah. Uh, who do, what should we wear now? Um. What do we do? A Resident Evil character. A Resident Evil character? Well, I mean, mm -hmm. we've done Leon. Okay, you know what? We're saved friends. <laughs> yeah, we're we're actually maxing right now. Okay, I can't really get a good angle of Isabella, good. but that that'll, that'll do. I think we just haven't taken a picture of Greg. Oh, we haven't talked. Yeah, we, we did. Oh, actually, I think we did. Oh, that's right. We took a picture of him out. Uh, damn, out damn. We, damn, we, were, saw, we, we saw plenty of uh, what do you call it? Time. Yep. If anything, we might be able to save a couple more survivors and then maybe stop it before last resort. Mm hmm. Yep. Yeah, because. Oh, 6 a.m. Yeah, I think that other. I think, yeah, but, yeah, they made this, uh, yeah, so you have to delay if you want to do jump kick. Do it instantly, you do, uh, flash kick for the most part. Yeah, it definitely... Yeah, those it, are just some real nice heals. And then, of course, roundhouse kick, you can still, you can do it uh, after jumping, but... You can't do it after a dodge roll, which is actually pretty useful. Yeah, because when Last Resort hits, we have two major stuff that's that we have. Besides Last Resort, we have a big major th uh, fight before Last Resort. <laughs> I like. Uh, it it feels very easy to decap decapitate zombies. With that, that is actually, if I recall correctly, I think there's like the two most useful moves in in the game is like jump, it's like jump, it's jump kick and uh, and the uh, flash kick because flash kick can instantly decapitate zombies and uh, and jump yeah, kick. Uh... Up. Oh. Oh, lights are back on. Yep, lights are back on. If anything, I think yeah. One, then one of the hidden survivors should be. Uh, should be available by now. Yeah, I think the other gentleman... Is, I think the other one might be a hidden survivor as well. I'm not sure. Uh, For now, we'll we're going to we're gonna head back to Wonderland Plaza and assume that the other uh, uh, survivor is there. I have to go this way. Uh, yep.
Yep, I think she. Actually, no. I just, I saw the lighting from the roller coaster. I thought it was a health bar. Yeah, no, it doesn't look like she spawned yet. Although we should probably get that PP sticker there. There we go. Nice. Oh, we can make a, we can make it some quick step while we uh, quick ah uh, quick step or uh, leap foot while we wait. Yep. Let's see. Is there a guy in here? I swore I swore there was like a guy that uh, that spawns in here. Up. Oh, we got blocked. Yeah, here. there is. I, I I just don't think he's spawned yet. Up. Oh, up. Oh, and I uh. Oh, you went headless. Yep. I went headless for a moment. Funny how these things are still here. You get no PP for that, by the way. Yeah, yeah. it's like we didn't we didn't notice those pop up while we were get, uh, getting Clint survivors. Uh, but if yeah, if you notice, you will know the coaches are coming soon because those tend us to uh, show up. We just didn't see notice any while we were dealing with Clint survivors. Yep. Or maybe they change it where they start appearing after the cultists show up, which weird change, but. Whatever. Okay, then. I missed. <laughs> you can uh, destroy zombie heads uh, if you do it on them. If you uh, need to drop them again. That's not the right place. It's the this one. Yep, this yeah, is the one. If you haven't much exploring with all the different food options, there are a lot of yep different foods that you can eat. Yeah, quick. If quick. anything, I. The supermarket's probably the best part uh, place in the mall to get a lot of the food for the food achievement. Mm hmm. Good thing about guilds that wine still spawns here. Unlike, unlike a certain like someone Bob. who uh, removed all the food from uh, Joe's sandwich. Jill would be disappointed. I don't know. The only reason why Joe's, the Joe Sandwich name existed because she nearly became a Joe Sandwich. <laughs> I think, I think, okay. I, think I think five should be good yeah, enough. Yeah, five quick steps should be uh, good for now. Um, I think I might have an idea where... Where one of the uh, secret survivors might be. Although it's seven a.m. now, so maybe, so maybe that old woman is here. Oh, oh man, we spo spoiled who the secret survivor is. No, it doesn't look she like it. Not there yet. Unless they put her on the other the, side. Unless they move, uh, yeah. Unless they move her to the other soccer ball. Nope. All right hmm. then. Uh, well, on to where uh, where I suspect the next set of survivors might be. I think you know which survivors we're going for. Oh, yes. Uh, 
There's okay. The cosmetic man is a. Uh... Okay, well that guy we can we can easily grab, but did I did I miss the turn? Oh wait, no. It's because it's a bit further back. Yeah, we we're we're on the long way. I completely missed the, uh, the jump kick. Okay, we're, I'm just gonna use the chainsaw for these for these assholes. Ow! Okay, enough with your fucking gun. I I think they're in there. Yeah, they're they're there. Yep, definitely. You gotta run out. You gotta run out. You gotta run out. Ow. Still breathing there, buddy? Uh, don't go, don't go, don't go too close. Don't go too close. Don't shoot again. Hold on, let me kill Just these. Man, you got some business with us? There's a helicopter coming. Be here on Friday. I thought you might want to ride. Come with me and you'll be out of this hell in no time. Where is it supposed to land? There's zombies everywhere. Perhaps the heliport? Perhaps the heliport on top of the mall, dipshit. There's a heliport on the roof over in the entrance plaza. But the security room door is sealed. There's a duct on the roof of Paradise. Right, Plaza. girl, calm down. A straight shot to the security room from there. Will you shut up for once, Alyssa? Hmm. Not that I trust you completely either, man. Brett, what do you think? About some food. You heard the man. Luckily, we already did that. Find your dust and take a picture of it with the camera you got there. Then we can talk. <laughs> well, I already thought of that because I already did. Feast your eyes on this. Is gonna have? Is gonna force you to pick it? Looks kosher to me, huh. Fred. Uh, Brett. Now, now, luckily, these three does... Oh, I leveled up. I don't need to heal. But yeah, these three are... They can be problematic at times. Come on. But I... But Let's these... not plus mutinies. Not mutiny kind of problematic. Just graveling kind of problematic. And that's just because they come equipped with guns. So they're going to be shooting up zombies, which is good because that means you don't, you don't have to babysit them too much. Bad, well, we might as well have, bad news uh, is they can accidentally shoot you. Follow me. Yeah. Come on. Okay, are they? Okay, up, oh, up, let's. Alyssa! Over there! God, she's like extremely far behind. Probably because she got grabbed by a by a freaking zombie. Which is not surprising. Alyssa is the one one member of this group that is the worst with fighting zombies. And it looks like her AI has not changed. She is still the worst at fighting. Her AI is probably not as it's not better. That's the best way I can say it. it. She still sucks at fucking fighting the zombies. Follow me. 
Okay, you're gonna have to- Oh god, I think- uh, I think they fell. Okay, we are gonna have to- We may have to spam a little. You're gonna love to hear the words, come on and follow me a bunch, folks. We might, as well, we might as well grab the sick man uh, while while yeah. we're come on come on if anything the old lady should also pop up to if, okay you know at this point if uh, at this point if she can't hold her weight then we're leaving her yep because we don't have the time at the moment come on sorry uh, so, sorry Alyssa, you're not you know okay that is the third time I've heard fucking Brad's line by another survivor. You mean Bert's? Bert's line, yeah. Up, up, nope. The list is coming. He's coming. That is a line that I first heard by Bert, and it is Bert's voice. So... It's strange. They have I guess they have to reuse some of the lines, but didn't want to have re recordings for different survivors. Yep. Which is a little late, but yeah, it is what it is. Follow, follow me. Come on, 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 come on. Follow me. If anything, I would send them to the bathroom. Yep, that's what I was thinking. Luckily his bathroom's right here. I'll have um Stand right here. I would actually, I would have them go in more so the zombies don't see them. Okay. Hold up. Excuse me, Brett. Over there. Hopefully they'll be okay. Yep. Yeah, they have guns. They shouldn't. You, you don't have to babysit them too much. Yep. Uh, okay, there she is first. Uh, I would get the man. I would get the man first because he can at least run. I'm pretty yep. sure, even though he's injured, she needs uh, assistance. Yep, and this time a bunch of zombies actually have shown up. Compared compared to the two hanging on the bunny right there. It's too dangerous to be out here. Uh, hey, startled me. D don't do th that to me. You look a little sick. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I thought my video was stuttering. Mm -hmm. Because uh, I ha I have been having some issues with the stream, but luckily. Don't worry about it. Everything's fine. We better get you taken care of. Follow me. We can treat your wound. If you say so. Huh. All right. Yep. He can run. He can run back to where the others are. Let's go save this. uh... A queen will usually take care of this problem really easily. We don't have one. We don't have one. Chainsaw can, uh, will suffice, though. Be because it takes care of the problem perfectly fine. Come on, ma'am. Follow me. You'll be my personal escort. What a polite boy. <laughs> boy? And that's how the conversation ends. Oh, honey, 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 honey. Don't, don't, don't run away. It's okay. She was, she was, she was heading to the waypoint that was created. She can move on her own, but it's faster if you, if you grab her by the hand and uh, escort her. Yeah, she's, uh, well, just like, uh, what was it? I think it was Floyd we left in the, uh, yep. antique store. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he he's an old man that can he was able to walk on his own, but it's easier to carry him because yep. of the speed. There's a gun shop in the North Honey. Plaza. Yeah, we know about the gun. We know you were in there. Yeah, yeah, you were. Yeah, we were. Yeah, you. We found you in there, punk. I almost said punk, but not not pal. That's what I meant to say. Uh, up oh, we we got magical uh, teleporting grannies. Follow me. Okay, Brett. 
Okay, everyone else is. Follow me. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes, game. We... Yes, game. I'm aware Come of the. Uh... Up the music's back. Oh, Granny has Granny has some has some hands. Oh my God! He about to throw hands with a zombie. They already took her purse. They they're not gonna let her let them take her life. Yep. This this Granny is least is at least better than the Granny we dealt with earlier. Miss, I want my dog. Yep. Okay. Come on. Over there. We're gonna have all of them stay right there. They shouldn't cause any. Leroy. Leroy, you Come on. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. All over here. Yeah, all of them can actually move fine, including including Granny over there. Yeah, she's doing a football tackle. She wants y'all fuckers to get out of the way. Yep. Thanks, fearless leader. Damn, we're at level forty already. Yeah, I, I if this was the original game, I'd still. Uh, we'd still be level like thirty something. Most like likely, early yeah. 30s. So okay, so yeah, so the grabs seem a bit easier to deal with. How much time do we have? Uh, yeah, I think we're gonna advance time a bit. Huh. Yeah, as you can see, for uh, photography's pride is just about gonna go off as last resort's going on. We're gonna trigger the cutscene. And then we'll save, and then we'll, and then we'll end the episode. Exactly. What is this last resort talk all about? Carlito said that he'd blow up the mall if he were cornered. <laughs> Damn, we got a regular suicide bomber on our hands. It's worse than you think. The explosion would send parasitic larvae into the atmosphere. He plans to spread zombies outside of the city? Is he insane? If that bomb goes off, there'll be nowhere to run. The zombies will be everywhere. I can't take... I cannot take Frank seriously. When he's wearing Ashley's outfit. He's planning to flood the area underneath them all with flammable gas, then set it off. If you could take care of the bombs while the gas concentration is still low. There's a chance we could stop the explosion. Let's do it. All right, so next episode is going to be fucking hell, by the way. Yeah, because not only do we have to deal with that, we have to deal with our good photographer friend again. Yep. The only thing we missed, though, is that we missed uh, Carlito's announcement on the thing. He was he was, say, he was saying it. Oh, but, I didn't hear it. Yep. Anyway, we're just going to save our game here. They gave us a lot of save spots. Yep. Well, folks... Uh, if you guys enjoyed the episode, please consider subscribing as we will really appreciate it. Oh, hey, our speed is maxed out. No, no wonder why we're running fucking fast. Anyways, uh, if you guys enjoyed the content that we do, please consider subscribing as we will really appreciate it. As it will help the channel grow. Uh, be sure to leave a comment and a like to help push this video on the, uh, on YouTube's crappy algorithm. And with that being said, we will see you guys in the next episode where... We're going to be dealing with Kent and his bullshit and making sure the ball doesn't fucking blow up. So, with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Until then. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.